Honey, are you still working? Oh, but why? I mean, do you really have to? Can't you just save it for tomorrow? Oh. I was hoping that we could cuddle, you know? I'm still really tired and sore from the full moon last night. And snuggling with you always makes me feel better. It's the best cure for a full moon hangover. Yes, really. Cuddles are good for the mind, body, and soul. They are proven health benefits. I'm absolutely certain of it. I'm sure if you look it up right now, you'd see so many health benefits. All of the health benefits. And you know why? <laughs> no, come on. You gotta guess. Well, yeah. I mean, it releases oxytoxins. But I was going to say that cuddling is a type of medicine. And it's called ibuprofen. You know, like the medicine. <laughs> hey, I thought it was clever. Oh, come on. You know it was good. Yes, it was. I can see you trying not to laugh right now. I can see you. Just admit it. It was a good pun. <laughs> oh, honey, don't be like that. You know you love me and my stupid puns. Oh, I love you too. Now can you please be done with work so we can cuddle? Please, 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 please. Finally. I was worried I was actually going to have to get out of bed and crawl my sleepy ass over there so I could. Well, honestly, I'm so weak that the most I could probably do was push you out of your chair. Actually, I probably don't even have enough energy to do that. So I probably would have just fallen asleep on the ground right next to you. So, next time this happens, and you try to put work before cuddles, I swear I'll fall asleep on the ground and make you drag me to bed. And that's a threat. <laughs> Yeah, come here. Just under the fuzzy blanket. No, the fuzzy blanket under the quilt. Too many blankets? Absolutely blasphemous. There's no such thing as too many blankets. Well, if we get too warm, we can always kick some of them off. But for now, I'm cold and tired and just want to cuddle, so please, just get under the blanket mountain and cuddle with me. See? It's not too warm. I mean, not way too warm. It's just... cozy warm. Like having a fever in the middle of summer. Yeah, you're right. Let's go ahead and get rid of a couple blankets. Okay, yeah, you're right. That's a lot better. <laughs> alright, alright. Quit bragging. Now come here. I want to cuddle you and fall asleep. Hmm, much better. Now, can I have a kiss?
One more. Mm. Thanks, honey. You're so good to me. Even when you try to skip cuddle time, which is absolutely unforgivable. <laughs> Don't stick your tongue out at me. You know you can't get out of post-full moon cuddles. I need my cuddles after all the transformation and, like, running and howling and all of that. Cuddles are an important part of the healing process. I need a minimum of seven hours of prolonged close contact with my favorite person before I'm completely recovered. Until tomorrow afternoon? Hmm. You know, I'm actually not sure that will be enough cuddle time. I think we might have to cuddle until tomorrow evening. Well, obviously then, we'd have to go to bed right after cuddling. And then we'd have to cuddle again because we're going to bed. It would result in a 24 solid hours of cuddling. But you know what? That's a sacrifice I'm willing to take. Okay, we'll definitely find a few breaks for snacks. But other than that, nothing but cuddles and naps. Agreed? <laughs> I'll take that as a yes. Mm. Definitely a yes, then. So, are you comfortable? I'm not, like, crushing your arm or anything, right? Good. I'd hate to accidentally make your arm do that weird thing where it gets all tingly and painful. Perfect. And not too many blankets now, right? All right. Then I'm going to lay my head on your shoulder. <sighs> Still comfy? Then I'm gonna sleep right here. Just wake me up if you want me to move, okay? Good night, honey. I love you. <laughs>